welcome back to Let's Play Majora's Mask. And down here is nothing interesting. What a letdown, huh? Okay. So you want to go on the water path right there. Unless you want to be surprised by this guy. In which case, just go that way. I'm just gonna get these pots real fast. Okay. So I one was a heart. You just shoot the balloon. And you go up here. And you'll find some more pots on your left. For ten rupees. Which I guess is a lot. Not really. Okay, then you just glitch up there. <laughs> well, well, a strange looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the Bombers Gang? Hmm, your manners seem much better than those of the mischievous friends from the other day. Arf, arf, arf. <laughs> that ill mannered troublemaker from the other day said he'd break my instruments. He said he'd steal my moon's tear. There was no stopping him. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble around the clock tower. Will he gaze in the telescope? Yes. Then you go up and zoom in on the clock tower. And there's Skull Kid. Then he looks up at the moon and there's a moon steer! Yay! And then, that's just mean. You don't need to do that. Yeah. Well, did you find that troublemaker? And that loud noise, what was that? Perhaps another moon steer has fallen nearby. Go through the door and take a look outside. But I wonder how that troublemaker got on top of the clock tower. The only way up there is through the clock door. And that opens only on the eve of the carnival. So you go through this door, and you'll find the moon's tear. Just go over to it, and it'll pick up automatically. <coughs> then you just go to... Go back to Clock Town. And then... Yeah. I'm probably going to do a 100% run, but yeah, I probably will. So that'll be fun, right? No? Okay. So you go back to the South Clock Town. I don't know why they call it South Clock Town, it's like in the center of everything. Yeah, it's weird, I don't know. Anyway... Go talk to this guy. Wait, wait, hang on. You have to wait for his slaughterhouse to get in the flower. This is my private property. Don't try using it when I'm not around. Okay. He says he wants something really shiny for his wife or something like that. And he mentions uh fuck you. He mentions a moon tear. Moon's tear. So I'm just gonna skip the whole conversation and just do this. And then he'll give me the Deku flower. So I can use it. You really help me out. Now I have the perfect souvenir for my wife. She hasn't set eyes on a jewel or sh what? she hasn't set eyes on a jewel or strange sparkling stone like this in a very long time. The title deed for this spot should be in high demand among Deku scrubs, but you already know that. If you don't need it anymore, you can always sell it. And who 
we, we'll need to do this quest four or five times. So, yeah. It helps if you have it memorized. You just get in it. And this isn't a normal Deca flower where you just go up a couple feet. This thing shoots you up like 50 feet. And it lasts a long time. And then you get a heart piece. Okay. So then you go back down, go to West Clock Town. And we're going to get to them later. But also, we're going to deposit rupees into the bank. So if you deposit a certain amount of rupees, you'll get rewards. And... My phone is ringing. No one. Okay. I'm going to this shop. Trading post. I'm going to talk to the scarecrow. Yo, hey baby. I'm a stylish scarecrow wandering in search of pleasant music. Time will pass in the blink of an eye if you dance with me. If you like, baby, we can forget the time and dance till dawn. Shall we dance? Say yes. And do this three times, I think. Well, it depends what day you're on. Do it until it's the night of the third day. Oh yeah, how was that? It went by in an instant, right? I'm still full of energy. If you like, baby, we can forget the time of dance until night. Shall we dance? Yes. Oh yeah, in that case, forget the time, let's dance. Familiar song? And then... Okay, lag. Say so yes again. Dawn of the final day. Are you kidding me? Dance until night. Yes. Night of the final day. Twelve hours remain. But he doesn't want to dance anymore because it's getting dangerous outside. And he knows a song that can slow or manipulate time, as he says. I'm going to say no, because I can just explain it to you. Um, the song that he knows can slow time down. And the other one, you can fast forward time to the next 12 hour mark. Which is convenient so you don't have to talk to him every time you need to go forward in time. So I'm just gonna go up here again. And I'm gonna uh wow. I'm gonna cut the video until it's time to go in there. So I'll see you when it's time to go in there. Okay, so it's time for the carnival. 
bunch of fireworks, clock tower's raising up, and then it goes down. Door opens, creating stairs. Don't stop now. Look, you can get up there. Okay. Thanks for the information, Captain Obvious. Okay. So, you go up here, like Captain Obvious says, and then look who it is. It's Skull Kid and the moon. Yes, the moon has a face, if you didn't know that. And he's got our arena.